I'm going to show you how to make a chicken tikka masala in 10 minutes. And here are my ingredients. I've got some sunflower or vegetable oil, crushed black pepper, skinless and boneless chicken breasts, onions, garlic, some double cream, tomato puree or paste, cumin, coriander, turmeric, chili powder, a bit of salt, and some garam masala. Then I have some coriander leaves for garnish and a bit of root ginger. So first of all, I'm going to heat my pan and I want it on a medium heat. Now I'm going to add my oil and that's about three tablespoons of oil. And then I'm going to tip in my black pepper and this is crushed black pepper. Give that a mix. And then I'm going to add my chicken pieces. You must make sure your chicken is cooking for 10 minutes. And I chop them into small pieces. And the smaller the pieces, the faster the chicken will cook. Let that fry for a minute. And now I'm going to add my onions. Tip those in. Now fry this mixture for two minutes and then add the garlic. And while my chicken is frying away, I'm going to make my sauce, which is the chicken tikka masala sauce with the cream and some tomato puree. Basically, I'm just going to mix that all up. And now I'm going to add my ginger and I've got root ginger here. You can take the back of a spoon and peel the outer casing. And you can remove as much skin as possible from the ginger, but it doesn't matter if you have any of the skin on. And just grate the ginger into the pan or chop it up. As you can see, the chicken is looking nice and brown on the outside, but generally, tandoori chicken pieces are used in chicken tikka masala dishes. What they do is they marinate chicken pieces in yogurt, chili and spices, and then they are baked in a clay oven or a tandoor. But this is the quick way where I've just fried the chicken in oil. 